our children. It's not a sunny here now, great. Love you, Vicki. One thing that stood out to me during the Prop 8 campaign, Prop 8 supporters were not afraid to pull the kid card. They were not afraid to say, oh, but what about the children? Well, I'm going to pull it right back on them. What about the children? What about the LGBT kids in this state? All two to 600,000 of them. What about the children being raised by LGBT people? What about their grandchildren, their nieces, their nephews, their cousins? What about them? So when they say, what about the children? What they really mean is, what about their children? Okay, so what about their children? They're taught that gay is wrong. Ours are taught that love comes in all shapes and sizes. Theirs are taught to exclude. Ours are taught to include. Ours are also taught from an early age what it is like to be excluded, thanks to their children and parents. Their children are taught that there is only one way. They are taught only what their parents want them to know, rather than all there is to know. They are taught to believe, they are taught what to believe, rather than the facts. They are taught that morality is a narrow road and that only they have the map. Our children look at this differently. Ours are given the facts and taught the beliefs need to be backed up by them. Ours are taught that the whole world, ours are shown the whole world and trusted to find their way with the love and knowledge we have given them. Ours are taught that morality must be aligned with justice or it will be neither. Ours are given the entire rainbow of colors, an entire world to paint them with. So to say, what about the children, is very misleading because they really don't care about the children. They teach their own children a set of values that will fall apart the moment their child hits the real world, causing pain and confusion. They try to condemn our children simply for being who they are or who their parents are. And by passing and upholding Prop 8, they have shown all children that justice does not matter anymore. It simply matters who has the louder voice. They are teaching that equality is no longer a foundation of our country, that the majority can vote away a minority's rights. We know this to be a temporary aberration and will teach our children as such. We will teach our children to never stop fighting for what is right and for what is just. We will never teach our children to rejoice over somebody else's loss. And we will teach our children that justice and love trump tradition every time. is really not about families because they set out to invalidate the families of these children. It's not really about marriage because they are trying to prevent loving marriages. And it is definitely not for the children because teaching a child to exclude is only the first step towards teaching that child to hate. So the next time somebody tells you that they oppose same-sex marriages, I want you to turn it around and I want you to ask them, but what about the children? Thank you.